Hi, I'm here at Strathclyde Business School to introduce the topic of transactions. At any given time, there are gazillions of transactions happening concurrently all over the place. For example, this is the McCants building, named after Samuel McCants, one of the chairs of the board of the old Royal College. And in here are all the departments of the university which deal with finances, like student fees and staff salaries. Once a month, they issue a transaction, which means that the bank reads my old balance, adds my salary to it, and writes back updating the balance. Meanwhile, this is the gym. It's named after the principal. Every month, Strathclyde Sport looks at my bank balance, subtracts a little bit from it, and writes the new value back. I mean, do we just hope this works? What could possibly go wrong? First of all, Strathclyde Sport read my old bank balance and they subtract a little from that amount. Then at the McCann's building, they also read my old bank balance and straight away write back a rather larger balance, including my salary. A little later, the Strathclyde Sport transaction finishes writing back what they calculated my balance should be, that's my old balance, less my subscription, overwriting my salary. I mean, what a royal cock-up. Let's learn how to make sure they do it safely.